At Specialty Eye Care Group, we uh, want to make things as comfortable as possible for patients, and as such, we use the eye care tonometer to check the pressure of a patient's eyes. During this video, we're going to talk about the tonometer, how to prepare it, explain the procedure to a patient, performing it on a patient, reviewing the results and recording them in Revolution, and then cleaning and storing the instrument. So this tonometer is used to measure the pressure in the eye. It helps the doctor to detect and monitor certain diseases, one of the most common being glaucoma. However, we use it for other things like red eye. Uh, it's also used to monitor how certain treatments are working and to see if the treatment needs to be modified for a patient. Now in our office, we have these probes and uh, we remove a clean probe from the case uh, we remove the tonometer from the stand and make sure that the screen's ready for the probe. It should say load. And then we carefully insert the probe into the tonometer, making sure not to touch the white tip. Then, and make sure that the probe is fully inserted in the tonometer uh, prior to, after inserting, recap the case and place it into the used container. The probe correctly inserted into the tonometer, as you see here. Prior to beginning the testing, we want to hold the tonometer so the probe is facing upwards and press the down arrow to make sure that the probe is functioning. You should see the probe bounce quickly. Uh, don't turn the tonometer upside down as the probe will then fall out. This uh, component right here that is gray, it uh, sticks out and it touches the patient's forehead and the dial on top adjusts that uh, back and forth. Uh, to be able to be appropriately measured for the patient. When explaining the procedure to a patient, we explain that this machine is used to measure the pressure inside your eye. It's able to measure your pressure without a puff of air. It's going to get real close to your eye, but don't worry, it's not going to uh, hurt at all. It's just going to be a soft touch. And then when we're performing the procedure, we want to first explain it, make sure that the forehead is positioned uh, right against the patient, and then hold the tonometer at a 90 degree angle so the probe lines up with the patient's uh, line of sight of their pupil. Then click the bottom button on the tonometer until the head of the long, uh, head of the probe um, hits the eye and then we hear a beep. And that'll be after six short bursts. A double beep means that we're not obtaining their accurate reading. The results, we know whether uh, they're good or not um, as such. After that long beep, we look at the results. If the difference between both of the eyes is greater than three, then we want to retest the patient. We'll write down those results or simply record them into our electronic system. Once we've recorded the results for both eyes, then we eject the probe into the, uh, the used container and uh, place the tonometer back on the rest. When we pull up the results in Revolution, we're gonna be going looking for where it indicates the eye care tonometer, and then we record the results and the time. The probes need to be disinfected regularly. We do that with alcohol. Using rubbing alcohol wipes to thoroughly disinfect or using the alcohol liquid, um, or we may use peroxide from time to time. We try not to touch the base uh, or the metal base, just the plastic component. Then we let the probes air dry on a paper towel for several minutes. And uh, when they're dry, we carefully, without touching the white component, put them back into a clean case. Then we place the uh, clean probes back into the clean case container. The tonometer is used to measure the patient's intraocular pressure. This helps the doctor detect and monitor certain diseases. One of the most common being glaucoma, however, it can be used for acute conditions like a patient's red eye. It is also used to monitor how certain treatments are working and to see if treatments need to be modified. So this machine is used to measure the pressure of your eye. It's a machine from Finland and that makes it so that we can get the pressure without a puff of air. Okay. So I'm going to get really close, but don't worry, um, there won't be a puff of air and it'll just be a soft touch. Okay. So go ahead and look over my shoulder. We're going to go ahead and get started. Soft touch. Good job. <laughs> now I'm going to do your other eye. Look over my shoulder. Oh. <laughs> Great job. All done. Thank